get that camera on my face. Can you see I'm tired? All right, so we just landed in New Orleans. Must say, the inside of the airport was kind of nice, but it reminded me of Mexico. And I'm not the biggest fan of Mexico airports. Up with the travel buddies, the Jacksons. Peace to the Jacksons. Peace to the gods. go get checked in at the Intercontinental of New Orleans. Although this wasn't the nicest hotel I've ever been in, the, the ambiance downstairs in the lobby, was it was pretty dope. But uh, once we got upstairs, you'll see. What was the upper room? Here we go with a quick tour, decent little bathroom, stand up shower, you know, just something light, something light. Little kitchen area, not kitchen area, sink, bed, you know, it's a hotel room. But man, they wanted to charge for everything. They had the little pressure sensors, I should have showed that. Little pressure sensors on the snacks and the juices and the water. Oh, you was gonna pay for everything. But we did have our own little balcony in private sectioned off with the dividers out there, you know, kind of look at what we were looking at, which was <laughs> just the next building in the street, but it was still nice. It was still nice. All right, enough of that, enough of that hotel stuff. So we out and about, now on these city streets. Don't ask me where I'm at. I'm down the street from the hotel at this little hill spot called Beetle Cat, Bear Cat, whatever. Uh, it was all right, it was all right. I mean, we waited two hours and it was not worth no two hours. Main Squeeze was dope, it's expensive, but it was dope. Um, forgot what juice I got, but Go ahead, it was bro. pretty good. My first time on Canal Street and it was pleasant. I must say it was pleasant. It was a pleasant experience. It was definitely a lot of people for a lot of different walks of life. Uh, kind of like a huge melting pot. But I enjoyed myself. All right, so some people go get murals, some people buy shot glasses. I have to go to the cigar places. You mind if I record? Absolutely. Oh, okay. I mean, not me, please. Okay, but... all right. Well, I'll record you right now. Um, tell me about it. Our stuff is, um, let's see, it's our own brand. We only sell our own, nothing else. Uh -huh. um, it's made primarily from Um, it's made primarily from Nicaraguan leaves. We do use some Brazilian leaves as well. So this place, so they uh, was basically self-contained. They rolled their own cigars. They had their own rollers, their own humidors. They aged them there, everything. And then later on, I found out they had another spot further in the French quarters. What you got in a Maduro? What do you, Maduro, what you got in a Maduro? Yeah, you're not filming, are you? I am, I can't film you. I am like me, I'm personally. You? Me personally. Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. I got you, I got you. Yeah, but 
but you know, because now with facial recognition technology, once you're on the internet, yeah, you know, I blur you out. The, I blur you, you know, out. Privacy, you know. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Buddy, I did not blur you out, but you know, it doesn't matter. Nobody watches my videos anyway. It's just for me. Right here you can see they got their rollers they hand rolling them right there in front of you these guys are laughing joking enjoying their time had no issues with any cameras or anything man they look like they was just living a life i damn near want to work over there you know they had the ladies hanging out it was a good time and so we're back outside deep in the quarter and this is where things got very interesting. You can tell a lot of stuff happens on this street. This street bourbon, and I'm not going to even try to pronounce that. But, yeah, over there. Like, one side was over there, and the other side was definitely over there. Parkway Bakery and Tavern. Check my blind spots. Hey, I seen it on TV, man. Got me the barbecue and shrimp. Oh boy, no mayo. You know I'm that white shit. So no mayo. Give y'all a quick look at the at the menu. Excuse me, excuse me. How you doing, bro? This is a quick look at the menu. I got the James Brown joint. It's a slow cooked barbecue beef, fried shrimp, melted pepper jack cheese, topped with hot sauce mayo. Take that out for me in a large joint. So we're gonna see what this thing hitting on. I'm uncancelable. Alcohol line, food line. Go to the food line. Alright y'all, so um Yeah man. Yeah. The spot I told y'all about earlier. It's a go. It's a go. Definitely go. Parkway bakery and uh whatever it's called. That's just a go. It's a go. 